Greetings all, Fanny here for Libra's Daily Oracle Message. Ooh, what flipped over? Okay. Libra, your first card is acceptance. Radical acceptance in the now opens the flow. Yes. The flow is in reference to the divine flow of energy and knowledge and the blessings that Spirit tries to bring into you in your life. Being in the state of flow makes it easier for those things to happen. It also makes it easier for you to trust the instincts of the signs and symbols that are trying to tell you. These messages that Spirit tries to speak to you through. Ease. It is easy for me to receive. It is easy for me to receive. It is easy for me to receive. Yes. Repeat that to yourself as an affirmation. And it will help raise your vibration and put you in that energy of flow. Grief. Tears are what happens when the ice of the heart melts. Fucking felt that before. It's like, I don't know about you guys, but I have held my heart very close and protected. And it has created a lot of blockages. It has created a lot of mistrust. And through like my past few years of energy work and, and clearing my chakras, I still have so much work to do on my heart to heal and be in a place where I can accept love. Where I can accept that I am worthy of love and passion and success. Because our heart chakra bridges the higher and lowers. Letting go. Everything is indeed out of control and God will hold it all. I can safely let go. Yes, Libra, it's okay for you to let go of the reins, to not be in control. If you're the kind of person that has always done for other people that have always made it work out, you feel a bit discombobulated when things are not in your control and not able to be handled. But spirit will hold it. Spirit will take care of it. You don't have to worry about it, my love. You just have to worry about you and fixing and healing your heart and the burden. Because, like, look at this. Look at the blackness on that side of it, which is difficult to see because of the green screen thing. I have to decide whether or not I'm going to keep that. But seriously, our hearts take on so much. Yeah, intention without surrender can be a fast a fast path to delusion. So Libra, don't be afraid to let go. Don't be afraid to cry. Please allow yourself to feel your emotions because each one of them are valid and each one of them is trying to tell you something. And so I can't really tell you what that is because that comes from your own higher self and spirituality and your connection to the realms. That comes from you. So with acceptance, letting go, delusion, ease, signs, and grief, things are going to be changing quite a bit in your universe, in your world around you. So accept that everything is out of your control. The only thing that you can dictate is how you react to the situations. Accept that spirit will try and do their best to help you and heal you. But you have to open those doors. You have to let them in. And you have to clear out your energy so that their blessings can come through. Let go of your limiting beliefs. Let go of your identity that you once held. Let go of your responsibilities. Because they are not your burden anymore, my love. Yes, of course, if you have a child that needs you, yes, that is your responsibility. You can't just abandon them. But... Balance and communications. If you have a partner, say like, hey, this is really weighing on me. Can you please help me out with this? If you have friends and support, say like, hey, I need some help with this. It doesn't make you weak to admit that you need help. It makes you incredibly strong to know that I cannot do this all by myself. I cannot handle this all on my own. And speak that to spirit. Speak to spirit what you want to have in your life. Speak to spirit what you need to have in your life. It is easy for me to receive. It is easy for me to receive. It is easy for me to receive. And that could be blessings. That could be situations. That could be abundance. Putting yourself in that higher vibrational place will help spirit work more in your life for your greatest and highest good. And so Libra, I love and accept you for the beautiful person that you are. Please give yourself half of the love that you've given other people and it will begin to create an incredible change in your life. Fill your cup up first because if you are in a state of imbalance, you cannot serve the greatest and highest good because your energy is all out of whack. 
So take care of yourself first before anyone else so that you can be that amazing person, so that you can be that warrior. Because you are. But you have to take care of yourself first. You have to be your own shaman before you can heal others. Have a beautiful day, my love. Remember to rest and drink your water.